come this way, baby. Who do you think you sense. are to talk to me like Girl. that? She's rough. She's tough. No, tell me. Tell me. Tell me. But outside of the reality TV chaos of hardcore pawn, Ashley Gold is something more. I had literally that aha moment where I was like, something's got to change. Tonight, this local woman talks motherhood, her new business, and why she had to walk away from the spotlight. And some would say she had a sweet deal, a reality TV show, fame, and financial success. But for Ashley Gold, there was a price to pay. Karen Drew takes us inside Ashley's Oakland County home to find out why the reality star walked away from the spotlight. I think a lot of people can learn from Ashley's story. The 38-year-old mother of two was overworked. Her health was taking a dive, and she was really missing out on some crucial family time. Yes, she was part of a hit TV show, but after years of success, she decided to call it quits. But what she decided to do has a lot of people talking. So, did you test that? This is how most of the world knows Ashley Gold. Because he told me. Excuse me. A tough chick working at a Soundfield pawn store with her brother and dad. Look, let me ask you something. No. No, you Shut. be quiet. Look, come this way, baby. Who do you think you sense. are to talk to me like that? The store, the staff, and the customers so interesting, a reality show is made of the business, and the ratings soared. I was in the pawn shop for my entire life, mm -hmm. and I loved it, and I thought that's what I was going to do forever, but I had literally that aha moment where I was like, something's got to change. Mm -hmm. She admits she was overweight, not healthy, and was missing a ton of time with her family. My favorite thing is layering. That's why Ashley Gold is spending much of her time now inside her Oakland County home. Put this on because this is a great color with what you're wearing. Okay. Running her new online business, Pawn Chick Shopping. She was eager to show me her line of jewelry. I have costume jewelry. I have, then I have genuine jewelry. While Pawn Chick is in the name, let's set the record straight, none of the jewelry has been pawned, but she is willing to go back and forth with the customer on prices. I travel around the country at all the jewelry shows and I get all my stuff new. Um, I get the latest fashion trends. I dress celebrities. She does everything from finding the perfect pieces. Like let's say I have these earrings on my website, so I won't reorder these earrings. I'll replace them with a newer pair. Running her website, packaging and mailing, but that's not all. Good afternoon. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'm Pawn Chick Radio. How are you today? She also has started her own weekly podcast. I interview a celebrity every week. They air on Fridays at 8 a.m. And I interview them not about me or how we can relate. I interview them about what's going on in their life. So those air out, and I'm having a great response from that. But most importantly, the 38-year-old says she gets to be home with her husband and 8 and 10-year-olds, living the life she didn't think possible, a businesswoman with time for her family. I'm a mom. <laughs> I'm, I was PTO president. Yeah. I'm that mom that drives the carpool. I dance around with my kids in my house. I have play dates at my house. I go out to lunch with my friends. Does she miss the show? Ashley says no, especially the craziness. But she did learn a lot. Negotiate, make deals, stand up for myself. Um, I have thick skin. Mm -hmm. I can take a lot. And I think nowadays in this world, you don't find many women who can stand up for themselves. If you'd like more information on Pawn Chick Shopping, her blog, or her podcast, we posted all that information on clickondetroit.com under the Lifestyle page. Karen Drew, Local 4 News.